This recording will show you how to do challenge shape one. I'm going to try to go through quickly. We're going to start with sketch. Just tell it where to sketch. That's where most people will mess up. I click over here and tell it what's on the front. That opens up uh, all my tools. Here's my rectangle. Drop down menu. Pick corner rectangle. Click once. Come over to uh, on top of the plane. Click again. Drag. Click again. That completes the um, rectangle. We need, now need to tell it how big to make the rectangle. I think this was supposed to be 5 by 3. We need to use the dimension tool, the double arrow. So I click on the double arrow. This was supposed to be 3 inches. I bring, it, bring the cursor over, highlight over the horizontal line, click, up, click again, and it highlights. We wanted this to be 3 inches. I type 3. Uh, I still have the dimension tool highlighted, so I come down to the vertical line and highlight that. Click, pull, click on the number, and we wanted this to be 5 inches. Okay, now this is something that a surprising number of people are messing up, and that is we need to give this thickness. We uh, Right now, this is like a piece of paper. It is two-dimensional. I'm spinning this. You see there is nothing there. It is just flat, like a piece of paper. It's called two-dimensional. We don't want it to be two-dimensional. We want it to be three-dimensional. So we need to use the extrude tool. I click on extrude, and the depth, we're, I believe, making it 0.5 inches. 0.5. Notice, by the way, that right now it was on new. If the, when it's selecting new or add, it will add thickness. If we were to select remove, it would take away material. So click check, and we have our block. Uh, this assignment required you to put a hole in the block. So we're going to make a new sketch. Once again, we have to select a sketch plane. Uh, I'm going to select the block that we made. Notice it is highlighted right now. I click on it. Now we can make uh, drawings. We wanted a hole, so we're going to go up to the center point circle, drop down, click on the center point, bring our cursor onto the um, block, click once, drag, click again. Tell it the size. How do we do that? With the dimension tool again. Click, come down. It was supposed to be 0.5 inches in diameter. Right now it's 0 0.9. We're going to make that 0 0.5. And uh, we also were supposed to tell it that we wanted it to be 0.5 inches from the side. So I'm going to, the way to, to tell, to dimension two objects, if I was to just click this once, it's going to want to tell this how big this line is. But if before I uh, tell it how big that is, I go and click on the circle, Notice it's telling it how far between, what is the distance between these two things. And we wanted that to be 0.5. Right now it's 0 0.56, 0 0.5. Enter. And notice it moved it up. Just to show that again, to dimension the distance between the circle and another line, I click on the one, and then I click on the other before entering the number. So click on the one, click on the other, now tell it how far. Click 0.5 and enter. And now we have the circle where we wanted it to be. We're supposed to make a hole. How do we make holes? The same way we added thickness with extrude. This cube, don't forget, I can't believe people don't know how to extrude. You've got to know how to do this happens in everything we every single part we've made we clicked on extrude now this um, menu pops up we don't want new or add we're making a hole so we say remove and we're going to change where it says blind click on the drop down menu click through all and now we have our hole you are always supposed to put your initials on stuff. How we do that? Again, sketch. Tell it where to sketch on top of the brick. 
and use the letter tool, the text tool, click, click once, drag, click again, type your initials, and accept them. Remember that I can move this around by grabbing the dot. I can change the size of them by using the dimension tool. If I change this from 2.4 to 2, my letters will get smaller. Um, and I can extrude this to our remove material. You can um, do uh, however you want. Um, I'm going to let this make a hole all the way through. There it is. That's the challenge shape one assignment.